Hi, I'm Vivian Smith. I was born on January 25th, 2002. And my proudest accomplishment to date, I would say, isn't one moment I can think of, but I would say it's kind of just the person that I've become and the strength that I've gained through a lot of experiences. Um, I would say I'm proud of myself for just working hard and not letting things kind of knock me down and still being kind of like a happy and exciting person through, I would say, hardship. So I think that's what I'm proud of, most proud of is my character and the way that I deal with situations. Um, and advice for my future self would be to kind of like follow my own path and live for me and not for anyone else and not be influenced by what others think of me or what others are doing and to just totally be true to myself because I think I struggle with that right now. So I'm hoping that over time I can mature and just be able to be completely myself and self-reliant. Okay, so how do you know Vivian? Vivian is my daughter. Okay. Um, what was Vivian like as a child, or what was your first impression of her? So my first impression of Vivian was when I was pregnant with her, she was breech and backward, which means she was head up facing in uh, when she was due to be born. And so I had to have a C-section. And so I knew that she was going to be her, her own unique person, from the beginning and she always responded to music and to this day she's a wonderful singer and loves music okay uh, what's something you feel others might misunderstand about Vivian or see differently um, that you appreciate because you know me so well um, I think that uh, Vivian is very comes across as very outgoing and very confident and very supportive of her friends and sometimes I think that that's mistaken for uh, the fact that sometimes she is insecure and she needs to be supported and taken care of by her friends. Okay, and how has Vivian influenced your life? Um, Vivian is my whole life. I, I don't remember what life was like before her 18 years ago. Um, she makes me laugh. She makes me cry. She challenges me. She... Um, she's everything. She's everything. Um, and what is your life philosophy or what words do you live by or imparting wisdom do you have for Vivian? Uh, well, I always tell Vivian to drive carefully, that it's no, you know, nothing is worth, uh, speeding up and making reckless choices and overall just making good decisions and have fun. Thank you. So how do do you know me or like how did you meet me? Um, I met you through cross country. I think it was my junior year and your sophomore year. And I remember I was doing like roll call or something and I was just going down the line and I saw <laughs> there were two new girls, Vivian and Sara. And just like from talking to you at one point, like I could tell like, you were gonna be friends and you're gonna be like someone I was like so interested in. So that's how I met you. Okay, and then what was your first impression of me? Um, my first impression of you, like, through cross-country and through that first interaction was that you were, like, really confident and, like, expressed yourself, like, however you wanted, didn't really care what people thought, and you were also, like, did I say confident? You were really confident, like, you didn't really care what people thought, and, like, so you were, like, afraid, or unafraid to be yourself, and you were almost confident in, like, a, like, intimidating way. But, like, I still wanted to be friends with you. I don't know. <laughs> okay. What is something you feel others might misunderstand about me? Um, that maybe that you, definitely that you're not as complex a person as you are. Like, you have, like, a humor and, like, stuff to say that you don't make known up front. But that once I got to know you and got to know those things, there was, like, another level to you. So definitely, like, your complexity, like, your humor grows and how much you care about pe the people around you. That is way better understood than what is um, apparent on the surface. Thank you. Um, and then um, how have I influenced your life? Oh, my God. <laughs> 
in like so many ways I could like talk for hours about it but to keep it short um you're the one person on the planet that I've met that's most like me and Mm -hmm. the one person that I've actually been able to tell everything to I've never really met anyone who I can be completely honest with like I can with you and that's opened up a new side of me and that's shown me the better part of me and if there's anything I've learned through my 19 years of living it's that you want to surround yourself with people who bring out the best in you and who you can be honest with and who make you completely comfortable and so my only goal in life is to meet more Vivians because you've changed my life for the better. <laughs> okay, so then you kind of said a little bit. Um, so what's your basic life philosophy or like words that you live by? Um, yeah, so definitely that what I just said and also just um, finding happiness and but in the most honest way possible and in the most uh, carefree way possible, but like within reason so I'm not I I may not be practicing what I preach exactly but definitely like telling people how you feel right away and if you want something like trying to get it and if you are passionate about something like going for it and if you have a gut feeling following it right away and just like seeking happiness through that way because even if it may not feel like happiness right away like I've realize that like that's how you'll be happy in the end and so I'm definitely still working on myself but that's exactly what I would advise other people to do all right 